Hello, sports fan. This is Steven here with Sports Choice Plus. I'm bringing you a very special breakdown. Y'all done poking bears? Y'all finished poking them bears? Before I get right into that, I want to make sure you're subscribed to the YouTube channel so you can get all the updates, all the breakdowns. Without further ado, let's get right into it. Looking on the eve of what we just saw, the Los Angeles Lakers just cooked the Memphis Grizzlies. On the back of not only Dylan Brooks getting ejected for his shot to the ground of LeBron James, but you got to keep in mind, there was a lot of talk around Dylan Brooks' comments after they did beat the Lakers in Game 2. You're looking at some of the comments he made about how LeBron is old, how he doesn't respect people until they put 40 on his top. And then when you think about just the, just the unmitigated goal, this guy has literally called out the Lakers franchise and talked so much trash about LeBron James. He's talked so much about what he wished he could have done when LeBron was with the Miami Heat. And you got to ask yourself, Dylan Brooks, did he just cause his team to lose this series? Probably. When you look at after the game that he uh, was ejected in, he did not speak to the media. He did not speak after the game three loss where they were destroyed. Um, and, and I think they made history the, the most gap as far as uh, between two teams in a first quarter of an NBA playoff game. They came out flat. You know, John Morant came back. The groin shot got him ejected. There was a lot of frustration. There was a lot of back and forth. There was a lot of at the expense of Dylan Brooks. The guys were going off. The Los Angeles Lakers came off, and before the game, you saw LeBron go up to him, say some words that you can't really hear or see. But LeBron basically looked at him and told him some things, and, and he backed off, shaking his head like, yeah, it's time. Now, I'm just going to say this. Dylan Brooks, LeBron did not put 40 on your head. He didn't put 40 up there. But they was beating the hell out of you when you was getting ejected. I'm just going to be honest with you. The Memphis Grizzlies are front runners. We know them as a team that doesn't really do anything. They have a lot of talk, though, a lot of a cachet. But the cachet hasn't been won by anything. When you think about everything that's going on, they have yet to win anything, but they have the loudest mouth in the room. And that's the toughest thing because you want to be able to say, okay, well, they have some type of thing that they can put against the Lakers, but it hasn't shown up yet. So did Dylan Brooks lose this series for the Memphis Grizzlies? That remains to be seen, but... The way that it's looking right now, the Los Angeles Lakers are rolling, and I don't see Steven Adams coming through that door. I don't see John Morant being 100% healthy, and I don't see Dylan Brooks saving today. So the villain role is getting their ass kicked. So definitely check out Sports Choice Plus to see what happens and see what goes on in the next round, uh, because at this point in time, Dylan Brooks may have just ended the Memphis Grizzlies season by running his mouth. Definitely check out Sports Choice Plus for all the breakdowns and all the updates. We'll see you on the very next video.